Howdy folks, my name is Winters and welcome back to this Let's Play series of Star Trek Online. We are moving on to the next story in the Delta Quadrant story arc and this time it is a TFO that uh, we have to do. Uh, anyway, let's get the mission brief and uh, see what it is exactly that uh, we have to get done. We've tracked the Bluegills to a hive complex. There, one of the Queens is directing an entire swarm. If we can take out the Queen, we can knock an entire hive out of this fight. Join with the group and head into the Delta Quadrant and bring the fight to the Blue Gills. So, we have to join and complete the Bug Hunt Task Force operation. Um, there's no rewards for this because we get rewards for doing the TFO. Uh, so, it's just a bit of uh, XP that we get. So, let's open up the TFO window. Uh, it said Bug Hunt. Here it is here. It is a ground TFO, so we'll uh, queue up for that. And hopefully, within the next 30 seconds or so, we should get... Uh, um, a pop-up and actually we'll queue up on advanced as well uh, just to um, double our chances of one of these actually uh, kicking off um, <clears throat> so yeah uh, the this TFO we basically um, we beam on to a planet uh, we meet a contact there and we have to advance into the hive. Do you know what? It, it, it's very reminiscent, actually, of Starship Troopers. At least for me, anyway. It, it feels very Starship, Starship Trooper-esque. Um, uh, yeah, it just reminds me a lot about the movie. Um, sort of advancing in, trying to fight back the uh, the, the insects. Because that's what, that's what this is. It's um, the bluegills. They're, they're kind of like an insect race. I'm actually very surprised that this hasn't kicked off yet. Uh, this is a first. Where was it? Here it is here. Actually, this is what I need to check. Yeah, bug hunt normal, bug hunt advanced. This is unusual. Eh. I'm sure it will kick off in a minute. Uh, this mission uh, gives a choice of marks, so you can either pick uh, fleet marks or you can pick Delta marks or Iconian marks, and of course, uh, playing it on advanced means that you can get an elite mark from it. In this case, it's an ancient power cell. Uh, for anyone that didn't know, uh, elite marks uh, you only get from advanced or elite content. Um, there we go. All right, so another couple of seconds. There we are. Load screen, perfect. So I know some people really don't like this uh, TFO, but I don't mind it. I actually uh, enjoy it. Um, now, to on Elite, yeah, it, it's a tough one on Elite. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll admit to that. Uh, you definitely need to have a good loadout if you're doing this on Elite difficulty. But uh, doing it on Normal or Advanced is just fine. No problems with that at all. Uh, right, so we got about 25 seconds until the start of this. Okay, so, see this guy here, he's kind of got a purple quality to him. Uh, he's an alarm bug, and you have to um, get those guys, kill them, before they have a chance to raise the alarm uh, in, in the rest of the hive. Uh, there are three of them all together, that was the first one. Uh, when we move on to the next stage, there will be another one, and once we get past that stage, there will be another one there then as well. Um, doing this on normal or advanced difficulty, it's not as necessary as it is on Elite. Uh, if you miss that objective, you simply get less marks, but if you're playing this on Elite difficulty, you have to kill those alarm bugs, and if you fail to kill them before they can raise the alarm, that's it. Mission over, you failed, and you get no rewards. Alright. 
So, um, this guy here, um, Van Driver, whatever his name is, he's going to blast a hole here for us to go through. Fire in the hole! Like so, and now we can player. advance. And there's going to be more of those alarm bugs. I'm going to drop some turrets. I'm going to drop some mines. And we need to keep an eye out for that alarm bug. There he is there. See him? Alright, so we go for him first. He's your primary objective. Because if he gets to over this side, uh, he'll bur bury through the ground and uh, basically he raises the alarm. Um, so, yeah. He's your primary target. Let's call in an orbital strike on this guy. Oh, wait, no. His health is going down pretty quick. Okay, let's not call in an open strike. Okay, and this is us moving on to the next area, so there'll be one Fire more land book. Clear to proceed. So we get in here, drop mines, drop turrets. Keep an eye out for the alarm bug. Where the hell is he? There he is. Excellent. He's taken care of. Looks like we got a man down here, so I'm going to try and help him. Okay, I think that's us moving on to the next area now. Okay, so once we have the area clear here, we're going to advance deeper into the hive, and uh, that will bring us on to the next stage. Here we are now. So we're jumping down. The scan show that we need to jump down this narrow fissure in the rock. This is Be the careful. fissure that we jumped down. I don't know what's waiting for us at the bottom. Let's get some mines out. Let's get turrets out. Engineers really rock uh, for this TFO because uh, if you can put out crap tons of mines and um, uh, mortars and uh, beam turrets and medical generators and all that sort of stuff, it's just it, it's so good uh, playing as an engineer. Have I mentioned recently that I love mines? Whoa, that was a big hit. Let's drop a medical generator, because I need it. Drop some mines. I'll take care of these guys.
According to our scans, there's a tunnel under us. Give me a moment. I'll clear a path. Nice. Okay, so he's gonna blast away this uh, uh, piece of earth here, and we're gonna Fire follow them. Like so. That first step. Same thing. Let's get mines out. Let's get turrets out. Alright, now we need to protect Cover this me. guy. So we drop a mine. Oh, you. You numb nuts. You know, I just trapped one of my guys. Oh, well, you're gonna have to wait there two minutes. We're going good, we're going good. There we go, right, now we can advance uh, into the final stage of this TFO. This is it, the center of the hive. Okay, we'll wait for the rest of them to catch up. There's the spawn mother. Hi ho silver! Away! Okay, let's call in an orbital strike. Let's drop some turrets. So we wanna hit her with everything we got. Absolutely everything. Booyaka! There we go. Right. Uh, I'm going to pick Fleet Marks, because uh, I'll get the daily bonus. 105 Fleet Marks, and an Ancient Power Cell, and 720 Dilithium. Thank you very much. Alright, let's leave the map. Right, and uh, now we can report in. Who would have thought that such tiny bugs could be such dangerous enemies? It's a pity they weren't able to see reason. So much squashing. Ugh. Okay. And that's it. 
we're going to leave it there for now. Thanks a million for watching, folks. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe. Do all that good stuff. I uh, appreciate all of your support so much. You have no idea. Uh, but uh, my name is Winters, and I'll see you next time. So until then, take care.